Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2017 with the Rude Man. We're back in Canada, and it looks like I'm going to get a little rain today. And that's unfortunate because we've got harvesting to do. And I got, as usual on the farm, when you get to a certain point on the farm, you've got many, many more things to do than you have time for. And I'm at that stage right now. I got tons and tons of stuff to do and no time now the the whether it's going to rain or not it could be looked at as unfortunate or it could be looked at as fortunate because i do have to get the crops off but i also have many other other things to do so you know, it may be a blessing that it's going to rain because if it starts raining i won't be able to harvest i'll have to stop my harvest and that'll give me time to do other things so let's get going with the harvest and see how far we can get. All right, so let me think here. I've got, how much do I have in straw? I probably have lots of straw, don't I? Let's take a look what I've got. And I, it's kind of hard to say because I think I've got straw in many other places than just the one. But let me see. Straw. Okay, I've got uh, a little over a million in straw. That's quite a bit. Uh, probably going to pick up the straw. What do we have on here anyway? What is this? This is barley. All right, so that's going to have straw on it. I'm trying to debate whether I want to use uh, course play or not. So, let's see. This is field one. Oh, do I want to? I might, just to pick up the straw. Picking up the straw is the main reason I use course play on fields like this, where there's lots of room around the field, not a lot of trees or hedges or rocks, and it's a squarish field. By square, it's not square, but it does have 90 degree angles, and it's north, south, east, west. So if you look at the map, there's no crooked fields on this map. They're all 90 degrees. They're all north, south, east, west. They're not in a, at an angle. On a map like this, I don't, I don't have to use course play because, like I said, they're 90 degree angles. They're squarish. Uh, they're big. There's plenty of, uh, of uh, grass around the edges. There's no trees or lamp posts. But if I'm gonna do the straw, I like to do the course play because that. Um, that lets me use the same course to do the uh, picking up of the straw. So, where did I start this darn thing? Up in that corner over there. So I think I'm going to do it, because I want to pick up the straw, I guess. I can always sell it or make compost out of it. Not all maps have a lot of production for straw. This one does. There's a lot of stuff you can do with the straw. So, let's get to it, and then the first thing I need to do is make sure I've got the, uh, let me make sure I've got the, what did that just do, Jump, dump a bunch of crap. Alright, it does have the, what I need, the uh, windrow. So, let's get going. Alright, there he goes. Let's get another one. I'm a little bit scatterbrained this morning. I had plenty of things on my mind this morning. And I came in decided I need to do a video. Uh, but I got a bunch of junk on my mind. And I'm not sure if I've got course is set up for what happened why did I put the wheels out didn't mean to do that right let's see if I've got I don't even know if I've got a course set up for these little fields here they didn't really require one three and four oh, I do actually hmm what is it what what 
Your shit. Where am I? What? Um. What the? What the heck is this? Where am I? On the map. That's odd. It says it's field three. But I don't see the start. That's weird. Um, I think this course is left over from before the update on the on the map. So yeah, I'm gonna get rid of this. I'm gonna get rid of this one. Miss dump it. Uh oh. What do I have on four? Add potatoes. I'm going to leave that for now. We're just going to hire a worker here. And there we go. Who we got working today? We've got uh, Mervyn Gilmore on this one. We've got Josh Lennon on that one. Let's get some tr trucks going here. And where are my trucks? Where's all my trucks? Okay, this is not... I've got cows in here. Let me get rid of these cows. I think in the last episode I was selling cows again. Not selling them, butchering them. Oh, that sounds awful. I was selling them. Okay, and then let's move on. Where's all my trucks? Oh, let's get this guy started. Mow grassy bottom. There you go. Go to work. Where are all my trucks? There's the new Scania truck that I have. I've been having a lot of people sending me uh, trucks since I was having trouble with that truck. <clears throat> but I found my own. And there's one. Where's the other one? I have one that I haven't actually tried yet. It's a weird mod because it says when you look at the uh, truck it's got a Mac Bulldog on it, and it's a Mac truck. And, but it says it's a Kenworth. Well, that'd be like saying my car is a Chevy Ford. Doesn't make any sense. Let's see if I can find this now. These are new trucks, so I don't have them in a category. So, where's my other one? I don't see it. So that means one of these trucks... I must have been borrowing a truck. Probably this one. I was probably borrowing this one. Let me see what I got. What did I put in here? Did I put the new one in? I don't think I put the new one in. This is the one I'm using. The other one was the Scania. Here, I didn't use the Mercedes Benz because it doesn't work with these trailers that I've got. That one there doesn't work with the trailers I've got. It, it's a perfectly fine truck, but doesn't work with those trailers. And I didn't put the Mac one in. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, let me pick up. I need another truck. Let me pick up another one of these. When I traded equipment, I traded too much. And then I need to find my trailer. It's not here. So let's see if we can find that. Where's the trailer? It's truckless is why I can't find it because I don't know where I left it. Okay, there's one of them. Where's that one? 
All right, here we go. Let's look. Let's look at it. We're going to look at this one. Where did it go? I lost it. There it is. Okay, this is the one we're using. Where's the other one? This This is the one I need. Where is it? All right, it's uh by the um it's by the what? It's by the cows. So let's grab our truck. Where's the dealer? Dealer should be around here somewhere. Where's the dealer? I'm lost. I'm lost. There's the dealer. Let's grab this guy. Let's put him in group number three. And I gotta check on my combines. Looks like one of them's full already. Let's go find our truck. Where am I? Oh, lost. There I am. Too many maps. I'm playing too many maps. Alright, it should be right here. Uh oh, I don't see it. Well, where is it? It showed it right here. It showed it between the pigs and the cows. Unless it was up here, between these pigs and cows. All for crying out loud. There it is. What's wrong with me? It's right there. What the heck is wrong with me? I must have ran by it ten times. I told you I wasn't with it today. There we go. Alright, let's go get these things going because it's going to rain on me. This other one, these are very small fields. Should be able to kick these out pretty quickly. Oh, he's done. Okay. Put your pipe out, buddy. There you go. It's kind of spilling on the ground. Oh no! I'm just gonna hire a worker here too, just to whip this out. There's not much here. It's a very small field. And then let's grab this one, haul it in. Naked girl on the dashboard. Wow, well, she's not naked. She's got something on. I just can't tell what it is. It's very little of something. Looks like her red hair's covering up most of it. I'm trying to see which ones of the gauges work. Some of them do.
I keep forgetting that this has the uh, the dump in the bottom there, the shoots, and I keep trying to overshoot the trigger. You know, like it's going to dump out of the back of the trailer like some of them do. All right, let's see. I need to go get some more pallets. Let me get this guy going. Let's stop him. Get him out of the way. Let's grab this guy. I still haven't got around to working on these fence. For some reason, these fence, every fence mod I've got is just terribly loud. Terribly loud. All right, let him go. Let's see, I can use this guy. I got some new Big Bud mods that I want to use. I've been using them on other maps. And I think I want to try to use them on this one. So I'm going to, I'm going to trade some of my tractors in when I get some money. Alright, let's see. This is uh, field number one. Let's do uh, harvest. And good enough government work. Where does it start? I think it starts at the other end, maybe. If I remember right. Yeah, I might trade my challenger in there. Um, although I don't think that's the challenger. That New Holland tractor there. And maybe the Big Bud Buster. Now that I have a Big Bud that works, I don't need a Big Bud Buster. Set this guy to the side for a minute. I need to find this guy because I need to go get some pallets. And where are my pallets? Over here. You know what I was going to do? I, I'm going to try that other little trailer. Do I even have one? Let's see. Do I have that little pallet trailer? That one. Where is it? I'm gonna try that. Let's let's unhook this guy. I was having trouble with that great big trailer there. I might need a smaller tra trailer if I can make it work with these pallets. Try this trailer. And let's see. We got a combine that's ready. Let me jump in that because I'm running out of time if it starts raining. Now I'm pretty sure that I did barley all around this time, so let's get rid of that. Let's see what we have for field 18. And field 18 harvest. Got it. All right, let's get this guy started here. Okay, we got uh, Scorpion working here. 
And I don't remember who was working here. Um, missed a spot. I don't know why it misses this side of the field. I, I, I think it has something to do with how the mod author uh, figured out the boundary, the field boundaries. I don't know. I'm not a map maker. I do know how to do some modding, but I'm not a map maker. I don't have the patience for it. It's kind of like why I don't fish. I don't have patience for fishing. Making a map takes a lot of time and effort, and you know if you're if you're not a perfectionist, it's just unbelievable amount of work if you do it right or attempt to do it right. What's wrong with that? We got somebody that's full up. The grass guy. Okay. All right. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't do a second uh, course here. I don't think. Let me see if I did or not. Grassy bottom. Grassy bottom to storage. I think that's the old one. I think that's the old course that went to... No, it's not. Let's see what happens here. Just curious. This one should go... This one should go this way. No. Um, it's not working. Mm. All right, let's get rid of this. Uh, let's see, let's stop the driver, get rid of that. Let's try that. And see what happens. Yeah, it's not working. Why is it not working? Stop. Oh, it's because it needs to be there. Drive the tourist. There we go. I got to figure this out. It's not working. I must have done something wrong when I made it. But let's get... Oh, shoot. Get this truck off the field. And then... I've got combines that are full. They need to get worked on here. Let me get this guy out of the way. Got to keep these guys going because it can rain and it won't be able to finish the harvest. Okay, so Scorpion's full. This guy's ready to move on. Let's get this guy moved on. We're going to move on to field number two. There is a harvest. And I think this one was redone. Because if you remember, field number two was two fields before. It was two fields before. Where in the hell does it start? That's the end. Where's the start? This was two fields before. And the mod author changed the map. Is this the start or the stop? <laughs> oh no. Let's see what this is. I'm just going to tell drive course, see what it does. Nothing. Oh, it's two combined courses. Stop. I forgot to turn off the other course. No wonder it was messed up. All right, let's try this again. Field number two. 
drive the course. All right, let that go. Let's get a truck over to field 18. Want to try to get some pallets going today, but harvest waits for no man. There we go. I need to work on those fence because there's this equipment. I set the sound so I can hear some of the equipment, but I don't want the equipment overpowering the sound on the game. And so sometimes if I take the time, if I'm driving those fence tractors, I have to go in and edit the sound just during that period that I'm driving the Fent tractors. It's a pain in the butt. And I haven't had time to go in. It's not just the time though. It's not just the time. What is that? What is that? They put, what? That combine put barley on my trailer. What the hell? I didn't even know it would do that. I, I didn't even know it would do that. How do you get it off? Unload here. That's not working. I don't know how to get it off of there. What did it do? Oh, I dumped it on the ground. Oh, crap. That was not the thing to do. Oh, I can't go through there. I didn't even know it would do that. All right, I'm looking for the pallet maker, which is right there. Okay, I don't want to pick up those things. I want to pick up these over here. How does that work? How does it work? I don't know how this trailer works. All right. That's not it. Stop unloading. I'm not unloading. How do you load them? All right, hang on. Well, I don't know how this thing works. I know at some point <clears throat> somebody told me to hit the G key. But that doesn't seem to be working. So I don't know. O G R. I'm hitting all the normal keys that you would hit. Left control I it says it's unloading. That doesn't seem to be working. I don't know how to use this stupid thing. All right, I go back to the big one, I guess. Work needs to be unloaded. Oh shoot, I got combine that's full. 
All right, Scorpion's working this one. Alan Meyer's working that one. Let's get this trailer. And how's Scorpion doing? Uh, he's full. So let's get the other truck. Go find Scorpion. We're getting a pretty good harvest here. The yields seem to be really good. Grab our truck again. Wherever I left it. Where did I leave it? Um, where did I leave it? I'll just have to be careful how I do this. I'm going to do the fruit first because it's easy. The fruit is really easy. Let me... I don't need that. Okay, work position. Pallets. I want your pallets. Give me your pallets. Me some more. I want some more. Alright, we're full up. Now, let me put the straps on. And let's see. We need that side, I think. And start on the end. I already put some in some of these. I already put some there and I put some on that one. It wasn't an equal amount, but that's okay. Oh, can I drive through that? Yeah, I can. All right. Okay, so let's put some here. All right, now, unload, unload center, but it's not center. Well, didn't take very many. Well, I mean, it took enough. <clears throat> didn't take them all, is what I meant to say. How many do you need? Well, whatever it takes, wherever it breaks. Work position, unload, there we go. Oh, sweet. All right, is that all? Was that all of the fruit? Oh, shoot. Why not take the straps off? That was silly. All right, put straps back on. Keep that thing going. Right, now, this was the part that was hard right here because trying to get the ones on the, on the vegetables was kind of tough. And I was looking for something smaller. And I don't think I have anything else. Let me look. Uh, Maverick had some stuff. 
The Maverick one had some stuff. Let's see what Maverick's got on here. That's not here. Hmm. Maverick had some different trailers. They were for coffee and stuff like that. So I don't know how they worked. Let me go back to the tippers. Tippers and see what we've got. All right, I got those. That's not going to do me any good. No good. No good. That one, but I don't know how the damn thing works. So, crud. I don't know. Papa Smurf isn't what I need. That's uh, for cotton. The Homers isn't going to do it. The Ultimate. That doesn't have a pallet trailer. This is the one for this game. This is the one for the previous version. I don't think it has anything in it. Uh, the sugar cane wouldn't have anything in it. I don't know. Let me go to the baling one. Baling technology, because that's where this trailer is. Okay, black sheep modding. What does this do? What does this do? Does this, this just does, uh, I don't think this does pallets. I don't think it does. Huh. I could try it. It's only 9,000. Let me try one of those and see what it does. But I think they, it just does, see, these don't show you what they do. Bale trailer, bale trailer, bale trailer. Yeah, I don't think it does, I don't think it does uh, pallets. Semi bale trailer. Tippers trailers are used to transport port to harvest. But again, it's a bale trailer. So I don't think that's it either. Right. Okay. I'm waiting for those to go away so I can get that one that's inside there. Oh, shoot. I don't want to do that. Ah, uh, all right. Okay, I'm wasting time. Hang on, I gotta go back and see how the harvest is doing. Okay, we got we got work to do here. Is he done? This field is done. Hey, harvest might be over. I don't have that many fields. I'm pretty sure all I have are these fields right around the farm. Uh, one two, three, and four. I haven't bought any other fields yet. I need to sell some product and gain some money. We're going to get our harvest out of the way before it rains. get it all I'm not get oh this is full too darn it I wasn't paying attention so I was dinking around with those damn ballots I'm, I'm looking for a solution in that I would like to have the the big pallet flatbed tra trailer works just fine. It works fine. But it's kind of hard to get into some of these small places that I'm needing to get into. So I'm looking for a solution in a smaller trailer. Now, like I said, there was a uh, there's a, a trailer on Maverick that kind of does pallets. I should look at it. It, It's interesting if you've played Maverick, which uh, I haven't played for a while, but if, you, if you've played Maverick, he's got these two flatbed trailers that when you first install the map, they're on your farm. And the, the bed of the trailer has pictures of coffee and stuff in it. That's the one I'm talking about.
So I'm looking for a solution, a smaller trailer, and I don't really care. The only thing that I want is a trailer that's got a solid tongue on it, not an articulated tongue. If you know what I mean on that is um, <clears throat> the wheels of the trailer do, don't turn. Some of those trailers you hook up onto them in the front, the tongue uh, articulates so the front wheels turn on you. <clears throat> That's all perfectly fine if you're going straight, but if you're trying to back up, it's kind of a pain in the ass. All right, I'm going to run back to field 18 because that guy's waiting where that guy over there is already done. We can come back and finish him off in a minute. I still haven't gotten pallets over to the cigar maker. All right, <clears throat> now we'll go finish off that other combine. And we're done with harvest. I'm pretty sure I can still pick up the straw in the rain. And now we've got barley. i got to figure out what to do next. I want to make some beer, and I need to find, figure out how much I've gotten hops. My fault, going too fast on the field. Now he's stuck. Do these trucks do four-wheel drive? They do. Drive control works on, on these trucks. That's another that's another plus for this truck. It's a little different, but it works. There we go, he done. Uh, as I've said before, I I tend to like to uh, do one harvest, like barley, all fields, wheat, all fields. I don't always do that, but I tend to try, especially if they're smaller fields. On bigger fields, it's not such a big deal. I've got a farm that I'm playing. Well, actually, I think it's Maverick. Um, that had the really, really huge fields. And I, I don't necessarily follow that rule because <clears throat> the fields are so big, if you plant hops, you get lots of hops. If you've got a farm like this where the first three or four fields you have are kind of small and you do a barley, you barely get a trailer load for harvest if you don't do all the fields in the same fruit. So I tend to do that on the smaller fields. Oh, I forgot about this guy. What's he doing? He's just a sat in here. Right. Let's see if I do the grassy thing. Mow grassy bottom. Why won't it let me do that? Because I've got him on that. Right. Okay. Mow grassy bottom. Drive the course. Let's see if this is going to work the way it's supposed to work now. I've got slurry there to pick up. I got all kinds of junk to do. I got more work than I know what to do with. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. At least I've got the harvest done. And that that's out of the way before it rains. And I'll continue on with everything else i got to do. I need to get these uh, pallets. I need to get 
some one of these didn't have was it this one this one didn't have compost in it and I didn't know that I got to get compost in it so god I got so much to do anyway I hope you had fun if you did give it a like share it with a friend subscribe if you haven't I'll see you back on the farm in the next episode in the meantime happy farming